My mic wasn't on. Hello, hello, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. This is going to be our first of many bonus episodes in which we try and catch up to where we were when the game crashed. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and... All right, let's speed run this tutorial. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. God damn it. God damn it. I suck at this. Nice shot. Well, that's a start, but I don't tell you what. I gotta go chase geckos away from right, our water on, supply come anyway. Come on, come on, come on. Let me skip through the dialogue. We did this last time. Come along. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. All right, there we go. Now let's just go ahead and start. Come on, I want I, I want to shoot all these. I like to shoot all of them down. God damn it. God damn it. Why am I sucking so bad? There we go. All right, now let's continue. All right. Yeah, so this is a bonus episode where we try and re catch up to where we had been when the game crashed a bit ago. Um, and this episode will end when we're looking at the campfire with sunny smiles, I think. So let's try and get this done as fast as we can, and I'll try and save a little bit frequently in the middle of it. God, Sunny is faster than I remember her being. Either that or I'm slower than I remember being. Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? Alright. Let's sneak up on them and get them from behind. Where'd the other one go? Ran away. Where are you, bitch? There you are. Ooh, he's right on me. There we go. Took him out. Ooh. Sunny. See, you're getting the hang of it. Okay. Yes. Let's go. Should've Let's fucking go! go. Alright, she gave me more rounds for my gun. She's gonna go that way, so I'm gonna take the high road. Ah, oh, whatever. I wanna try and save the woman this time if I can. Here we go, in much better shape to try and save the woman this time. Let's see if we can do it. I'm hit. Save the woman! She's in a, she ran up in a direction where it's, it'll be much easier to save her now, which is good. Let me switch over to my pistol. Damn it. That was unfortunate. We weren't able to save her. Yeah, it's a little hard to save her, especially if you don't have the pre-order weaponry. Ah, oh, hell's bells. There's not a day passes. So, well, but we you already heard this dialogue. Thought I might. Couldn't hurt. All right then. We'll need a couple ingredients to get started. Gonna want some Xander root and a Brock flower. Yes. Okay. Hang on. Let me through. There we go. Now in this reality, I'm gonna drop a quick save. Oops. There we 
There we go. Da dum. All right. Let's go harvest all of that meat. Damn, I'm really upset we weren't able to save the woman. All right. Let's go ahead and ba -ba bum. Loot these guys for all they're worth. Take a sippy sip of water to make sure we're well hydrated. Because we are in survival mode after all. That's weird though. I have those did I loot those ones already and forget? I don't know. So if this game had a settlement building mode like uh, Fallout 4 has, what I would definitely do is if you become well liked within the community of uh, Good Springs, you should get the water source as a settlement. I feel like every single community, if you become beloved by them, should grant you a key for give you a key to unlock a workbench. If there was a uh, settlement building in this game, and it would, yeah, especially because that would just be a really good reward. For, for, for gay, like, helping out settlements, you know? I might reiterate that again outside of the bonus episode, because I feel like there might be some people who skip this bonus episode. Mmm, meat. Give me meat. That one's already empty. I don't really use hotkeys a lot in this game, by the way. I hope you guys are gonna... So you guys are gonna have to get very used to me pulling up the Pip-Boy all the time. Sorry about that. As I walk, I'm just gonna adjust my feet a little. Ugh. I love the music in these games. Look at the bird! Bird is the word. Bird, bird, bird. Bird's the word. Don't you know about the bird? Well, everybody knows that the bird is the word. Where's. Where's that fucking. There we go. Oops, uh, hang on. Uh, okay, there we go. Alright, now we gotta kill all these bugs up here again. And then I'll drop another save just to make sure we're not, you know, screwed over if the game crashes. God damn it. How am I missing these? There we go. <coughs> Come on. There we go. Come on. There we go. Get all of this fresh meat. Uh, 
Gimme, gimme. Ooh, gimme, gimme. I feel like there's more Brock or more uh, bloat flies, but whatever. Oops. Ah. I'm so used to hitting escape to close menus. I mean, we got to drop a save anyway, so let's do that now. What I got to get used to is dropping a save after every combat encounter. Alright, and when we get down to Sunny Smiles, the bonus episode will end and the full, the real episode will begin. Or you know what? Maybe I'll just make this one extra long episode. I think I might just make this a single 30 minute episode. Fuck it. That's what I've decided now. Uh, rather than breaking this into two parts, this is just going to be a 30 minute episode. Yeah. Because I feel like that'll, that'll just be overall nicer in terms of uploading and editing and viewer experience. I mean, and if you guys really don't want to see me redo all this segment, you can just fucking fast forward, you know? Just fast forward. Ah. <sighs> I adore this game, though, for real. For real, for real. Alright, so we're gonna get down to Sunny Smiles. We're gonna... Uh... And we're gonna continue the tutorial stuff. Yeah. I hope y'all are enjoying the start of this series so far. Let me get another sippy sip of water. And Sunny should be just over this ridge. Yep, there she is. You see her? Dun, 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 dun. Normally I'd have the radio playing in this game, but I don't want to get copyright claimed. Hey there. Let me see what you got. Yeah, these will do just fine. Just fine. All right, now. We're going to be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give it a try. All right. Healing powder. Wow. Two of it. Nice. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. <laughs> Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. All right. So hang on, if I want to make gecko steak, blowfly sliders, I would need some pe some cactus fruit to go with it. Gecko steak, I need to have one more point in my survival skill. Damn. All right. Well, let's make our way up to town and talk with that. Talk with Trudy. Let's also. Uh, sip water and drop another save because I'm scared of crashes. Come on. There we go. Poor woman. I like her dress though. I want to dress like that. In game and in real life. Alright, come on, over this hill. Sometimes traveling the world can feel like it takes a good bit of time, but I always have fun with it. I love the, the crazy purple hair I went with. I hope the next fall game gives us an RGB slider for our hair again. It's such a silly thing, but it's so great. 
All right, and now into the Prospector Saloon. We beat Sh uh, uh, Sunny Smiles there. Ha <laughs> ha. Take that, Shiny. You bitch. Howdy. I'm done being nice. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get nope. out. Hmm. Well, that seemed like quite the character. Oh, uh, I didn't mean to walk on top of this. Please, I just want to sit in this chair. Game, there we go. <laughs> Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Mm. I overheard your argument. What was that all about? Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this traitor, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Hmm. Where's Ringo now? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. What are you going to do? Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Powder gangers? Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. It was a big escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. Why not just kill Cobb and be done with it? You mean murder him? That's not our way, even if Cobb is scum. He can bluster and threaten all he wants. All right, let's change the subject All then. Right. Um, you know what? I think I got. I want to step away, do something else. Be careful Be right out back. there. Hmm. Oh, dog's here. Hello. Hello. Ah, it's under my eyes. Oh, ah, e. Oh, that smarts. Ooh, that smarts. <laughs> up and up and up. Held up in the gas station, she said. Ah, look at that. An old sunset sarsaparilla machine. You know, I, my, my papa taught me a trick that if you sort of come at these at the right angle and sort of give them a little shake as you reach in, you can get things out without needing pre-war money. That's close enough. Who Ooh. are you and what do you want with me? If you're going to shoot, you'd better not miss, partner. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? You know how to play? Sounds like a blast. Think I or I even brought in some sarsaparillas for us to split. Uh It's a two-player game. I, I know I know how to play it, please. You build a caravan using the cards. Yes, in your I know deck. how to play it. The like goal audience is to doesn't. create caravan bids that beat your opponent's bids, so there's more strategy than luck involved. It's why you won't see caravan in any casino. Too slow-paced, and more importantly, no house edge. Here, take this holotape. It goes into more specifics about the rules. You'll also need a deck, so take one of my spares. So, you feel like playing a game? Let's play, partner. 
Don't worry. I'm not that good of a player. All right. Let's go. Uh, so he's betting... Oh, 54. Jesus. All right, let's give it a go. Let's hope we don't lose this. Um... All right, so I've got a full deck. Yep. Right. No, okay. I, I haven't added any. Let's add... Hang on. Can I do add all cards? No, okay. Hang on. Ah, uh, shit. How do I... Uh, S to randomize. Oh my god, this is a slower process than I want it to be. I'm a fan of having a big caravan deck. So we're gonna put a lot in here. <laughs> Come on, please. <laughs> A lot of people don't like Caravan. I love Caravan. Hang on. Can, well, can I go faster with, like, scroll wheel or something? Nope. Okay, this is just the speed it goes at. Look at the face. Look at the face on the jack and the top stick. I love it. The king looks like he hopped right out of a Franken-Basque animation. Alright, there we go. Let's play Caravan. So, you want to get as close to 21 on a set as you can, compared to your opponent. You can either climb up or down, and uh, let me check, the different faces have different effects, but I don't quite remember them. Let me double check that. Hang on. Sorry, just trying to get thing up. Fallout New Vegas Rules of Caravan Independent Wiki. Always use the independent wiki because, uh, fuck, um, fuck the, fa the fandom website. It sucks. Sucks ass. Here we go. So. The faces. Joker. Play against Ace, 2 and 10. So when played on an ace, it removes all cards of that face value. And when played on a number, it removes everything of that number. A jack? Uh, will remove a card and any cards attached to it. A queen will reverse the flow of a, a deck. And a king adds a multiplier to the card you put it on. Okay. So let's start off with, you know, one seems like a good point to st start because I can, uh, I can slowly tick my way up. And on the other side, we'll start on the, in the other direction. Oh my god, he's already at 18 over there, huh? Wait, is it not 21? What is the, the the burnout number then? Let me double check that. Oh, under 21 and over 20. So between 21 and 26 is where you need to be. Fuck, he already got that one perfect. Fucker. Okay, what does Jack do again? Jack. Removes the card and anything attached to it. So let's get rid of his king. So it seems like his method is to try and get to 21 as fast as he can on a thing. All 
I'm not allowed to do another six, am I? No, okay, so I gotta do it over here. Um... Teen. I can get this to 25. So let's do that. We'll be matching him. Um, fuck. He's very close to immediately ending the game. It's 26 is the, the absolute cap, right? So if I do a 26, or if I do a 6 over here... Oh, I can't fit a 6 there. Hang on. But I can if I do a queen. I hope I'm not fucking this up. I hope my memory's serving me correctly. This should be literally perfect, right? What? Oh, fuck. I think I- I think 26 is too high. Fuck me. Well... Oh well, we're li we'll live with it. Let's take a sippy sip of that sarsaparilla. And let's drop one for him. Because I said I would split them with him. Oops. How do you... How do you pick up and manipulate an object? Hang on. How do you pick up and manipulate an object in Fallout New Vegas on PC? <laughs> uh, what, how do I grab? By default, it's the Z key. There we go. Shit. There you go, buddy. What is it? So, do you know there's a man named Joe Cobb looking for you? Yeah. He doesn't look very tough, though. Drop my phone. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. Hmm. What are the par why are the powder gangers out to get you anyway, partner? My caravan was on the return trip from California and heading back to the company branch in New Vegas when we got jumped. Not even a drop your weapons and hands up before the bullets started flying. We put up a good fight, but there was too many of them. I took a few of the bandits down before I ran, so I figure their friends are out for revenge. Hmm. What are you gonna do about them? I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Hmm. Maybe I can help. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board. I'll ground. See who can round up. Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. All right. And with that, we've got a, our first goal. We're going to try and help Ringo fight off the Powder Gangers. Be sure to come back next week in order to see that.